last month, uh, rangers in Yellowstone National Park killed a coyote that was stealing food from park visitors and employees. MTN's John Shear explains why the animal problem in the park are more often people problems. So here's the scenario. You're walking along a path here in Mammoth in Yellowstone and a wild animal comes running up. It's a coyote, you know, about the size of a medium sized dog and it begins to badger you. So you do what most people do. You drop the chips and get out of there. So what did rangers do? We tried to do some aversive conditioning. That means scare it away using... Like a paintball gun. So how did that work out? That did not work out well. The coyote came right back to its old tricks. So rangers had to kill it. The animal was getting aggressive and could have easily attacked and hurt someone. But you can't blame the coyote. So coyotes are incredibly smart animals. And people feed them. It doesn't take very many times for an animal to get fed before it's, it's probably its death sentence. This has been a problem in Yellowstone for more than a hundred years. And when an animal gets fed... Uh, they don't unlearn that behavior. And just moving the animal really doesn't help. You know, if you were able to relocate them, uh, they're going to have that behavior wherever they go to. Rangers say the only way to put a stop to things like this is to stop people from teaching coyotes they can get food from humans. In Mammoth at Yellowstone National Park, John Shearer, MTN News. Now Townsend says when people see animals in developed parts of the park, they need to let rangers know right away so the animals can be chased away for their own safety. Again, don't feed the animals.